One of the most important components of space research has always been the quest for Earth-like planets. However, over the course of their job, scientists are often exposed us to entirely odd planets that couldn't be more different than our own blue home planet. They range from gorgeous Earth-like habitats to worlds dubbed hell planets due to their cruel surfaces. They are planets made of diamonds as well as worlds in deep freeze. Planets so near to their stars that their mass is being torn away by the second, and planets so distant from their sun that we're not sure how they can survive. Let us take a look at some of them in today's video. Before we begin though, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to stay notified for future uploads. Venus to start off this video, we'd like to emphasize that it's not required to conduct a search for really strange planets in unusual galaxies. In fact, one of the most peculiar celestial bodies lies right on our own galactic doorstep. Venus, the second innermost planet of the solar system, has striking similarities to our own terrestrial home in terms of mass and size. It is also known as the Earth's sister planet. A deeper examination of the unusual occurrence that occurs on Venus reveals that the two heavenly planets are significantly different from one another. As a result, we now know that the supposed twin of the Earth is one of the most inhospitable environments in the whole solar system. This is mostly owing to the planet's atmosphere, which is primarily composed of carbon dioxide. Finally, a minor quantity of nitrogen and traces of different sulfur compounds complete the celestial body's natural protective shell. The surface of Venus is encased by a dense layer of clouds, approximately 12 miles thick. Unlike on Earth, however, these clouds are mostly made up of caustic sulfuric acid rather than water. This acid is present in the form of minute droplets that rain down on the lower air layers on a regular basis in a continuous cycle, then condense and restart the process. This is only one of countless strange occurrences on Venus caused by the celestial body's super-rotation, which means that the upper atmosphere near the equator spins far faster than the actual planet. On Venus, powerful storms erupt, reaching speeds of up to 250 miles per hour. Trace 2b While the nightly view of the firmament astounds us with its countless brightly illuminated celestial bodies, there are also planets in the vast expanse of the universe whose natural composition places them at the opposite end of this sparkling scale. Among them is traced to be a planet about the size of Jupiter that is located about 750 light years away from our blue home planet. A thorough examination of the celestial body that circles a bright star in the constellation Dragon revealed a sobering revelation. No other planet is as black as Trace 2b, and the planet's albedo is set to 0.01. In other words, the exoplanet reflects less than 1% of the Sun's incoming photons back into space. This darkens the planet even more than pure coal, which still reflects between 3 and 5% of light rays, and the explanation as to why the planet is this way was discovered in 2006. Its black visage is ultimately caused by the combination of various distinct components, with the assistance of the transit technique. To begin with, the planet's surface has blistering hot average temperatures of nearly 1800 degrees Fahrenheit. Such intense heat, in turn, precludes the creation of usual ammonia and water vapor clouds, which are generally quite light and colorless. Instead, we detect the gases titanium dioxide, potassium, and sodium in the atmospheres of this certain exoplanet. However, the presence of these chemical components cannot account for the planet's ubiquitous darkness. Terrestrial scientists concede unequivocally that they are presently unable to solve this dark planetary riddle beyond a shadow of a doubt. Gliese 436b It's extremely astounding that the surface of planet 436b is over 1500 degrees Fahrenheit. However, it is not the primary cause for the celestial body's repeated appearance at the center of scientific attention. The cosmic tail that the exoplanet pulls behind itself on its trip around its mother star is what draws so much interest. The distance between Gliese 436b and its parent star is over 3 million miles. Thus, just a little more than two days and 15 hours elapse before the planet, which measures 33,550 miles in diameter, completes a full circle, causing part of its atmosphere to escape into space. This atmosphere is the last ingredient that combines to generate a magnificent cloud with the shape of an enlarged comet tail. In fact, this galactic appendage is 50 times larger than the star around which Gliese 436b revolves. It is assumed that the ice giant loses up to 1,000 tons of hydrogen in the process in just a single second. 
Experts hope to gain important realizations about the emergence of super-Earths in the context of detailed investigations relating to exoplanets like these. They believe that the members of this celestial body class begin their galactic life as Neptune-like ice giants. As such a planet gets closer to its mother star, the outer ice layer melts, exposing the solid rock core of the celestial body, which can then be somewhat habitable, if the conditions are right. Kelt 9b The reason why Kelt b is also known as the Hell Planet becomes evident when we look carefully at the incredible heat that reigns on this planetary inferno with a surface temperature of up to 7,770 degrees Fahrenheit. With its hellish temperatures, the planet, which is situated roughly 620 light-years from the Sun, is by far the hottest planet we have identified so far. The exoplanet is hotter than even some stars, yet it is just 3 million miles distant from its parent star. As a result, Kelt 9b only takes 1.5 days to circle its host star. Interestingly enough, the planet has a fixed rotation, which means it always faces the same direction as its star. As a consequence, the day side of the celestial body warms up so much that even hydrogen bonds there are ripped apart, and the planet's heavily ionized atmospheric gases are irreversibly degraded as a result of the hot host star's UV radiation effect. Experts believe that this process, which results in a loss of atmosphere, is expected to continue until the whole exoplanet vanishes from view, ripped apart by the forces of the Sun. WASP-12b Experts believe that WASP-12b doesn't have much time left in this universe. In reality, the gas giant, which has nearly 1.4 times the mass of Jupiter, is circling its star in an increasingly tighter spiral motion, and in a few million years, the mother star's tidal forces will rip the exoplanet apart. Currently, the celestial body, which is about 600 light-years away from Earth, takes about 26 days to completely orbit its star. The two objects are separated by only 2.1 million miles. As a result of this spatial constellation, WASP-12b is already losing significant amounts of its natural gas supply. The narrow distance between the host star and the exoplanet is also responsible for the enormous surface temperatures, which have been measured at around 4,000 degrees Fahrenheit. WASP-12b is one of the darkest planets we've discovered in the cosmos. So far, the exoplanet seems to be as black as asphalt, However, it's not only worth looking at the intriguing surface qualities of the celestial body, the interior of the planet is also fascinating due to its natural composition. Many scientists think the core of the celestial object is likely to be diamond or graphite. HD 189733b It is commonly recognized that terrestrial precipitation may take many distinct forms, including rain, hail, and snow. When we feel irritated with the weather prediction and the projected regularities, we might recall that we and our world could have been considerably worse off. For this reason, let's have a look at the strange weather patterns that occur on the exoplanet HD 189733b on a regular basis. As opposed to frozen or liquid water, thousands of jagged glass particles rush through the sky, accompanied by intense storms reaching wind speeds of over 4,300 km per hour. The tremendous temperatures that exist on the huge planet allow for this one-of-a-kind procedure. Because the celestial body circles its host so closely, the temperature there easily soars to nearly 2300 degrees Fahrenheit. At such high temperatures, the silicate in the environment finally reforms into glass particles. Because these small particles reflect incident light, the planet appears to the viewer as a deep blue hue. So there you have it folks. Did you like today's video? Let us know in the comments below. With this, we're going to wrap up this video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more incredible videos. We hope to meet you guys again in the next video. Till then, peace out.